more than 25 or 30 years back, in schools it was taught that the sun, it revolves, but it does not rotate about its own axis. So, the atheist, he will say, is this mentioned in the glorious Quran? I will tell him, no. What does the glorious Quran say about the motion of the sun? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the glorious Quran, in Surah Al-Anbiya, chapter number 21, verse number 33. It is Allah who has created the night and the day, the sun and the moon, each in its orbit, moving in its own motion. The Arabic word used is yasbahun, which refers to the motion of a moving body. So the glorious Quran says that the sun, it has a particular motion. And from this verse of the glorious Quran, we understand that the sun, besides revolving, it even rotates about its own axis. And today after science and advance, we have come to know that the sun, besides revolving, it even rotates about its own axis. And today in the books of science, and we are taught in school as well, that the sun besides revolving, it rotates about its own axis. And the sun takes approximately 25 days to complete one rotation. Who could have mentioned regarding the movement of the sun? And that besides it revolve, it even rotates about its own axis. Who could have mentioned this in the glorious Quran 1400 years ago? The atheist, he will give a pause. He will be silent. Don't wait for it. Continue.